William Pena was an officer with the 28th Infantry Division as they fought in the Colmar Pocket, a line of strong German defenses in the Alsace region on the border of France and Germany. On January 19, 1945, the 28th moved toward Colmar. We were under fire by machine gun, and the platoon leader heard something. He raced up, and he got hit with a machine gun. I didn't feel a pulse. I said, he's dead. Pena took over the platoon, and within 10 days, Allied forces reduced the front line by half. On January 29th, Hitler gave the order for a partial retreat, but as Pena and his men advanced, they encountered fierce German resistance and were forced to travel through mine-ridden enemy territory. And this mine was on the side of the road. And I stepped on it and I blew up, I don't know how high, maybe several feet high, and fell into a ditch. And I knew my feet were ablaze with fire. I mean, it was just hot. Pena lost his foot to the German shoe mine and was evacuated as the 28th fought on. By February 8, 1945, French and American forces pushed German troops back across the Rhine River and out of Alsace. William Pena spent the next two years in hospitals recovering from his wounds and was promoted to captain before leaving the army.